The Americans came out to support their players tonight, a sold-out arena. Sloan Stevens, Grand Slam champion, 2017 U.S. Open. And if you're not familiar, that previous year, she came off of an injury. She was ranked astronomical, so high, I, I don't even remember, like ranked 2,000 on tour. She would come out of nowhere and win the U.S. Open, and she was the hottest thing in tennis. Unbelievable. Taking on Little Lauren Moneyline Davis. Now, these two ladies have had some epic battles. Lauren Davis, 24 and 18 on the season. She started things off great, taking the title at Hobart. Racky Mova in the first round. Bandle. She even beat Sloan Stevens, Wong Blinkova, and Elizabeth Kokr. Elizabeth Kokr. Elizabeth Kokrito. That's right. In the championship, she would take her out and Sloan Stevens, guys. Look at this here. <sighs> no chance. Lauren Davis has no chance to win that point. Now, Sloan dropped the first set. She'd come back and win the second set. In the third set, it was all about keeping Lauren Davis deep behind the baseline, just like you saw there. Now, Lauren is not going to win many points six to seven feet behind the baseline. No player on tour, for that matter, is going to win points that far behind the baseline. It's just so impossible. Elena Rabakina, maybe, but you're just not a threat that far behind the baseline. You're only playing for defensive purposes at that point you're literally at the mercy of your opponent great strategy from sloan stevens in the third set it's good to see murray back in her corner check out his podcast on the tennis network i think he's releasing new shows amazing beautiful strategy now sloan stevens 22 and 16 on the year listen we saw her win saint mellow she literally has made two quarterfinals a semifinal three round of 16 appearances 13 and 5 on clay. She had a great stretch on clay, but this is what it came down to, ladies and gentlemen. 71% of her first balls in play. She won 62% of them, and she won 50% of Lauren Davis's first serves. Unbelievable. 17 breakpoint opportunities, too many, Lauren Davis, and it was one of those days at work for Lauren Davis. As the Americans get ready for the U.S. Open, Lauren's going to have an extra week to practice and see if she can possibly go deep like she did last year. We rode her, guys, the first and second round, both underdogs. Watch out again. The ladies shake hands at the net. Sloan Stevens is victorious in Cleveland. And whoa, this crowd really showed up. Beautiful.